In Genesis 1.26, it says, Then God said, Let us make humans in our image, after our likeness. You have to cooperate with God in that. You have to have an image and a likeness that is higher than your lower view of yourself. You have to equip yourself with something beyond the picture that you've held in the past, filled with self-doubts and filled with all of the focus on that that is not right instead of that that is right. Think about the following ideas to give yourself a new picture of you to project on the screen of your mind. The inner mind is like a photographic plate. It takes the images that you give it. Well, beginning right now, beginning this week, you're going to give yourself a Christmas present of a new image. And even though it's inside of you, others will feel it. Others will sense it when they're in your presence. Emerson once said, what you are speaks so loud, I can't even hear your words. It is because we project our image that we hold of ourselves. Well, think about the following ideas and give yourself a new picture of yourself. First of all, say to yourself and write these things down and do it religiously. Say to yourself, God created me. I am loved and needed. God created me to be a part of God's world. And God needs me to fulfill a special purpose in God's divine plan. And then make the following ideas a part of your mental picture. I am not alone. Always God is with me. God is within me as strength and light and power. God's Spirit lifts me up and out of any kind of depression or negation. God's light shines in my mind, quickens a new spirit in me, a new understanding in me, a new awareness in me. Now, I ask you to complete the picture by affirming, I have within me all that I need to live successfully and to be the kind of person I long to be, the kind of person I know in my heart that I can be. I have God's own spirit in me. I have been created in God's image and after God's likeness. I pray today, this week, that you have a new picture of yourself as needed and as a beloved child of God.